Some individuals are exempt from rules that should apply to everyone. A hero is suddenly a risk factor the moment the war is over. So you murder him. Crude, but effective. In reality, they have no need for living heroes. Just dead ones. Here's a question, Alex. Can we stop Captain Mateus Torres? Depends on if you treat the captain or three strikes as a singularity. Both are. What happens when two singularities exist on the same field? That requires seven months of calculation with current resources. We'll just have to trust the guys in the field. David, evacuate. No, I still have to finish up here. The Erujan military finally sent part of the Alicorn specs. Its basic capabilities listed here were as we predicted. What's interesting is this over here. In addition to main guns, they have a 600 millimeter, 128 caliber rail cannon. The barrel exceeds 70 meters. Its range is over 3,000 kilometers. That matches what we calculated from the bombardment on Anchorhead Bay. The mini nuke they seem to have obtained has a yield of one kiloton. It'll destroy anything within a 400 meter radius of ground zero. Casualties are to be in the tens of thousands. I know some things are better left unsaid, but let me say it. That's less damage than I expected. Nice catch. Do you remember this speech? This boat has the means to end this hideous war in a definitive and elegant manner. The world shall be horrified by the number of lives we will take. Only then will they let go of their weapons. Weapons that would have taken the lives of 10 million. The imagery invoked by those words and the actual predicted damage just don't match. So, here's a question. <laughs> Sorry, got no quizzes for you today. They will launch the nuke on September 19th. Why are you so sure? Because that's the anniversary of the end of the Continental War. Anti-war demonstrations and victory parades are in full swing in Ored. There's about a million participants in total. That number will rise on the anniversary. <sighs> However, this nuke isn't that powerful. They'd have to thread through the eye of a needle to achieve their desired result. Terminal guidance would be needed. Right. How do they intend to achieve it when even GPS won't work? You're all thinking too much. If we sink the submarine, it's problem solved. Crude, but effective. <laughs> Crude? All right, look at this. The Alicorn's expected course. We know it was off Anchorhead Bay, and it has to get to Ored within range before September 19th. They must avoid being detected by Osea and its allies' sound surveillance system and ships. Taking into account its maximum operating depth, this is the only possible route. The Alicorn will move along the Azalea Seamount chain and reach a rather blandly named body of water called PX-80443. The waters here are shallow due to an undersea mountain range in nearby islands. This is where it'll be. We also know roughly when they'll arrive in the area. Quite the prediction you have here. Indeed, but if it makes it through, then you're looking at Peony Trench. The sub's max operating depth is 600 meters. Tracking it would be impossible. Right. Now I'm going to give you the mission details, so listen up. Our mission is to cooperate with the patrol aircraft to find the Alicorn. In the first phase of the mission, multiple patrol aircraft will drop sono buoys to build a sono buoy barrier. Then, in the second phase, we narrow down the possible location of the Alicorn by analyzing the data obtained from the sono buoys. The results of our analysis will be data linked and shown on an overlay on your radars. And for the final phase, Trigger, you're gonna look for the submarine. We acquired one special MAD, a magnetic anomaly detector, for this. It'll be on Trigger's plane. Fly over where we expect the Alicorn might be. If the submarine is right beneath you, your MAD will detect it. You'll also have nautical charts on your radars, so use them. Once it's found, our fleet will commence a unified attack with Asrox and sink it. And if we miss? Four ships will be joining the operation. There won't be a second salvo. So who's flying, Wiseman? Everyone except myself. Oh. This is in order. 
Now get your fat asses moving. Strider Squadron, sortie ASAP. Well, it's time for some treasure hunting, Trigger. Oh boy, I'm excited. Hey, stop screwing around. Don't be such a hothead, Ocean. We all know what'll happen if we screw up. Sector 1, we'll deploy the Sonoguri Barrier. We're all prepared to buy the farm, and that's why there's so many of us. According to calculations, just one needs to fly to locate it. Those aren't the sort of calculations we like, are they, Trigger? Damn right. Same for the rest of us, too. They're here as predicted. Detecting hostiles. They're definitely aircraft from the Alicorn. <laughs> Trigger, you take the lead. The patrol aircraft must be protected. All aircraft, follow Trigger. We'll call. Understood. Understood. Roger. Understood. Three strikes, rebels in the killing. Catch him like that. Go! Let the wings off that degenerate! Strider 2, engaging. Strider 3, engaging. Cyclops 2, engaging. He must have been waiting for us in the air. Cyclops 4. David, here's a question. How many aircraft can the Alicorn carry? 20 to 30, depending on the type of aircraft, but it's unconfirmed intel. It's time to warn. With three strikes, you can reduce them to a single digit. Nah, you can reduce them even more. That shirt's sure because of trigger, but those are calculations I do like. Know the answer soon enough. Toss out far from the control aircraft. Not bad. Debris from the downed aircraft is landing in the water. When you know the bodies, I mean the debris stops raining. We're detecting additional UAVs. Intercept them. So there were more hiding. Trigger, can you get them? Strider 1, missile away. Acquire's locked on Bandit. Firing! Prioritizing the ones close to the patrol aircraft. Target acquired. Bandit on my six. I can't get them off. Sit tight. Our air patrol and the LRSSG will find them. Breaking. Enemy has a lock. Missile away. Got him. We'll fall out of the sky. Missile. Our ghost pal is in a tight spot. Missile. Missile. So what if the calculations say Missile. we need one of them? There are people aboard those planes. Yeah. Oh, We're going to make sure it doesn't come to that. Missile launched.
All aircraft be advised. Our radar's picked up new hostiles. Go back underwater where you came from. Missile. Locked on. Missile. Missile. Missile away. Missile. Fox 2. Missile. Fox 2. Missile. Situation normal. Should we clear the baffles, Captain? Caution. Chase by sea. Pursuers will be airborne. Enemy Missile targets bound. I'm going to Our patrol aircraft are in trouble. Mayday, mayday, mayday! <laughs> Control down. Protect the remaining aircraft. No more on my watch. This is a fire missile. More incoming. Not bad. Not bad. Shit. Hold on tight, guys. Thank you, my friend. The missile to be dropped. No problem. Send they must be very frustrated right now. It's nearly impossible to find us in these open seas. Come if you dare. Three strikes. Strike one. Put this away. Protect Spectre. We've lost the tackle. Our job remains. Special control. We need to cover them. Victory is a chance to interfere. Floating through hostiles. Locked on, you're mine. Enemy missile inbound. Clear for impact. Our patrol aircraft are under attack. Friendly splash to hostile. That was close. That's it, Trigger. You're the key to our success. Lost control. I've lost control. Uh, we lost a patrol aircraft. Only two remaining. According to my calculations, Let's stop relying on calculations. Shit! That's on me, Trigger. I couldn't defend them. Strato 1, target acquired. Enemy has a lot. Grenade! Target is hit! We have it. Firing. All systems dropped. Barrier completed. Analysis complete. Under removal. Power core is navigable zone. Roger that. Displaying the search area on your radar map. The Alicorn somewhere inside that ring. Activating the MAD. Do you see the waveform indicator above your HUD? Fly over the search area and look for a location that induces a change in the waveform. We're treasure hunting for real, huh? All aircraft except Trigger. You're on contingent combat air patrol. Oh, Trigger, leave these chumps to us. It's so much easier if you can see The MAD won't function at high speeds. Fly slower than 800 kilometers an hour. Let alone sag. I got a bandit on lock. Splash one. Fox two. This one's mine. The submarine may be huge, but it's still gonna be like looking for a needle in a haystack. Attack missed. Trigger, your MAD's getting something. The waveform on your HUD should have peaked. Turn and fly in the direction where the waveform peaks. Come on, Sharky. Where are you? Trigger, your MAD is showing a stronger reaction. The Alicorn must be near. You set the hook. Now you just have to reel it in. Picking up a magnetic signature. Signature lost. I'm seeing strong noise in the MAD signal. Shit. They predicted that we'd use the MAD. Seems like this is our contingency. We're going to see the source of the noise on the ocean surface. It's likely similar to a buoy. I don't have a window, so I don't know about buoys, but I'm detecting strong radio sources. Correct. That's it. Sending the location of the jamming devices. Destroy them. Trigger, let's destroy the jamming buoys. A bit of a chore, but we'll have to destroy them one by one. Destroyed. How'd it go? Wait for the sonar buoys to respond. 
Shield barriers. I have visual. They look similar to the Arsenal Bird's defense system. So what do we do then? We don't have Stonehenge to bust through them, you know. Enemy Nicole. submarine diving. Nicole. My fellow submariners, your lives carry weight. It is you the right to take the lives of others.
The Alicorn's hull is severely damaged. No, it's completely split in two. She really pulled it off. And that's our final answer. <laughs> I see loads of floating objects in the waves. I don't think there are any survivors, Wiseman. Copy that. The enemy submarine has been destroyed. Operation is complete. That was unbelievable. Just all of it. That's right. Yeah. There are some who send those around them to their doom. Like Captain Mateus Torres was a devil incarnate. But there are others. Others who show the way to everyone else. Those who stand at the forefront to cast the light. Those who follow them can't help but feel that they're in the right hands, that they'll make it. This is an era where there isn't a singular answer, like a quiz question. The world awaits a hero to keep the torch aloft, banishing the darkness. Quite the poet. That's a story I'm gonna have to tell my kid. All aircraft and David, the operation is complete. Return to base and get some rest. Oh man, finally time for some munchies. Get to hand me the burger over there? Oh, and the knife and fork too, please. Once I get back to base, I'm heading to the mess hall. Operation is complete. Can we celebrate now? Yeah. Good work. Yeah! <laughs> yeah Your next mission's in 32 hours. Whoa. Not <laughs> something I'll tell my something. son about. Give me a break. I'm good, Alex. Won't need that wake-up call every two hours anymore. David, only the summary is fine. Give me the report ASAP. I'll hand it to the president. That's why I haven't slept in the last 80 hours. 78 hours and 52 minutes. Okay. <sighs> well, now to the conclusion. Assuming that three strikes is a singularity, why not terminate him? There is a fact that has been observed in all of the missions three strikes has taken part in. All dependent elements that either mimic or follow the subject have increased chances of survival. Try to be more sensuous. Go Trigger's way, he'll make it. He meets the way. Really? Significance is high. <laughs> That's uncharacteristically illogical of you. <laughs> is that really how you laugh? <laughs>